my presentation is about the situation of cholera in Haiti and how we uh, identified the hotspot in order to uh, target the elimination we are we want. Like you know, uh, in October 2010, the Fibrio Coleo was introduced by massive uh, con contamination. I, sorry. Okay. Like you know, in 2010, October, Vibrio cholerae was introduced by massive contamination of the Atibonit River, Sewer Group O1, Ogawa Sewer Tip, El Tobio Tip, well known in the Indian region since 2007. It was a new Vibrio uh, in a native, a naive population, no benefits from mass immunization and an explosive epidemic has begun. In 2010, up than, sorry, up than a 4,000 suspected cases per week and 4,000 deaths was registered with an incident about 80. And one year later, almost the double of this incident. Say about 34. Like you can see here, that is the overview of the evolution of the cholera in uh, this year from uh, to, uh, 2010 to uh, 2019. We achieved the lowest incidence rate now in the a epidemiological uh, 30 uh, in this year. Uh, zero, zero, or 0.02 per mil, uh, 1,000 population. The last positive cases confirmed in the last was reported in the epidemiological week uh, six. Also, one case will still under confirmation was reported in March by a private a laboratory. But until now, we don't uh, find, uh, confirm these cases. Like you can see also, uh, 2080, more or less than uh, 40 uh, uh, case suspected, to suspected cases uh, was positive. But uh, since uh, January, we don't have, we don't register suspected cases in, in the country. Now, in order to uh, uh, control uh, the uh, epidemic, we identified some uh, department we, we like a priority uh, to, uh, in order to make uh, um, uh, to get in measure uh, to eliminate the cholera. Like you can see, uh, the, uh, priority, the department we, we, uh, we was uh, prioritized is Artibonit, a center, and west, with a, a stable, a, a, with incidence uh, for a Artibonit a zero, a 06, a center. 1.4 and west a 0.2. It's the pre of vaccination activities in IT. In order to classify uh, the hotspot in Haiti, we, we can see the area we 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 in the we can see the area of previous vaccination i already was that in in the national plan of uh, cholera in 2000 in 2000 uh, uh, 
16, an analysis done to classify area as tip A, B, C, based in the number of week that they in red alert. In like here, you can see uh, eight communes are considered as persistent and priority tip A, source zone uh, with at least a fifty percent of the weeks on red alert since uh, twenty fourteen. A seven percent persistent coming in a second priority a tape B and three recurring community of dead priority of tip C, like you can uh, see with a, a color yellow. A red and red. The, the criteria to a choice a hotspot identification of cholera spot limited on geographical area, city, municipality, communal section, where environmental, culture, and socioeconomic condition facilitate the transition of the disease, and where cholera persists or repair. Regular, hotspot play a central role in spreading uh, the disease to other area. The methodology we use the two methodology, the quali qualitative and quantitative analysis, analysis to identify the common to target wash OCV a surveillance. I think. A qualitative analysis was based in water sanitation access, population migration, difficulty of access, border area, yes or no, if yeah, and others. And a four qualitative a analyze based in a publication from an experience in Malawi. We use uh, our national surveillance data from uh, 2030 up to uh, 2018. Here, like you can, uh, like you can see, incidence was not enough to see the persistence of cholera between 2013 uh, up to 2018. We use the variance to detect when the incidence was sustained. For example, the coming of Sekakavajal uh, as a higher incidence is not uh, is not is not a the coming of Sekakavajal uh, as a higher incidence in this period of time, but is not sustained, so it doesn't apply as a hotspot. Like you said, the uh, it, 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 um, it's not a it, it's a in, instable uh, incident. And then, like you can see also, uh, we can try other a uh, country like a hotspot in base of this uh, met methodology. You can see Saint Michel de la Talai, uh, Eneri, uh, Altibonit. Gonaïv, Gomon, and Leicester. That is the same for the center, Las Caobas and Ench. For the west, Cabaret, Taba, and Cornillon. Hotspot hot zone common proposed by a targeting. You can say a, like a, a hotspot for targeting the measures where we have to concentrate a, activities like wash and a, a other measures by the government. We have ba atibonit, ba a ba atibonit in a blue. We have Bar Plateau in yellow, 
Uh, we have O atibonit in uh, red, and uh, O atibonit, uh, O plateau in, in red. That is the host, a common hot, hot spot, hot zone to make intervention. And then target population was the, a, about a, one, a, a one, uh, one million, a, one million, a nine, a nine, uh, mille. This is the oh, I see. <laughs> a target for population. You excuse me. Summary, we can say in 2019, lowest incident level we got in the country, low mortality, no more positive cases than January. Hotspots have been identified using a surveillance data from 2018. Uh, up 2018. Uh, Cholera elimination is possible, is near, uh, we can feel it, but we need to reinforce, uh, uh, reinforce of the alert and response system, swinging laboratory surveillance, testing cases of diarrhea beyond suspicion, wash capacity building water, adequate a vaccination strategy or spot and accentuation of research.